Well, the years start coming and they don't stop coming. This is one of the pieces of news that I think we were all expecting to see at some point, if not at some earlier point in the NHL season. But the Blue Jackets have relieved Jarmo Kekalainen of his duties as GM. John Davidson, along with the team's hockey operations management team, will assume GM's duties while the club goes through the process of hiring a replacement. Now, this doesn't really need too much breaking down. We all kind of acknowledge that Jarmo Kekalainen's time in Columbus was probably going to come to an end soon. You could say that John Davidson, his time is probably going to come to an end soon as well. But just for craps and giggles, let's go out there and read the press release on the Columbus Blue Jackets website as to what they have to say about this entire thing. What is the Stinger doing here at the bottom of the page? Ask a question. Sorry, Stinger. Get out of here. Oh, boy. Can I even scroll down? Yeah, I can scroll down. Well, he comes down with us. That's really funny. Nice little overlay. I want to see Finn on the Canucks website. That's pretty cool. But CBJ have relieved Jarmo Kekalainen of his duties as GM of the Columbus Blue Jackets, President of Hockey Operations, and alternate governor John Davidson announced today. Davidson, along with the team's hockey operations management team, will assume GM's duties while the club goes through the process of hiring a replacement. Media availability with Davidson will be streamed live on the Blue Jackets YouTube page at 8.30 a.m. Eastern. So, what is that? 1.30 p.m. PST, my time? and it'll be recorded and posted afterwards on bluejackets.com. This is one of the hardest days I've had in my career, as Yarmo is a friend, someone I have a great deal of respect for, and someone who has done a lot of good things during his time here, said Davidson. While the future of the club is bright, our performance has not been good enough, and it's time for a new, fresh perspective as we move forward. Kekalainen, 57, was named a third GM in Blue Jackets history 10 years ago! My goodness, he lasted that long? 2013! I didn't realize he was hired 10 gosh darn years ago! The club amassed a, okay, this is going to be funny, 410, 362, and 97 record in 869 games during his tenure, which is the longest tenure in franchise history. Now, do the math on that. What's 869 minus 410? That is 459. So the Blue Jackets were actually a negative team with... Kekalainen here over the past decade. Columbus qualified for the playoffs five times in 2014, 17, 18, 19, and 20, and posted its four winningest seasons based on points percentage during that span. Ay ay ay, that's kind of sad, isn't it? Like, a decade of under... no, not under 500, just like around 500 hockey, and you have your best four seasons in that span. Ay ay ay, Columbus, eh? On behalf of our ownership group, I'd like to thank Yarmo for his hard work and commitment over the past 11 years, said Blue Jackets majority owner and governor John P. McConnell. He and Tina and their daughters are special people who will be a part of our Blue Jackets family, and I wish them the very best in the next chapter of their lives. Now, when it comes to this update, I mean, you could very well say that this was overdue. You could very well say this probably should have been done earlier when the Mike Babcock thing was going down. You could say that there were a number of moves and rumors and all these conversations that started up that maybe would have warranted a Kekalainen firing earlier in his tenure, but hey, he lasted this long. The Blue Jackets, I guess, didn't really feel the need to do that until now, which, I mean, that decision is very odd to see how it comes about on February 15th, 2024, but either way, that's the update here, I guess. The Blue Jackets have relieved Jarmo Kekalainen, and when it comes to potential replacements, this is what Elliot Friedman said on the Jeff Merrick Show. One of the names that jumps into his head for the CBJ job is Mark Hunter. Rick Nash is there in Columbus and knows Hunter very well from their London Knights days. So, hey, Mark Hunter, maybe he's the guy. Who really knows? You can let me know your thoughts in the comment section below if that would be the appropriate way to continue, but... Yeah, Yarmo Kekalainen is fired. Maybe Mark Hunter's next up for the job. Thoughts in the comment section below. I hope you enjoyed this British Rolls 99. And bye.